welcome to another video. I'm Kalila or Callie. Oh, did I switch that up? Yeah, usually I'm like, I'm Kalila or Callie. Welcome to another video, but it's okay. Hi, welcome or welcome back. I am wearing the sweater that I blocked in the last vlog. It looks so nice. I love it so much. I'm loving my hair so much. I'm just obsessed with this color. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, anyway. Mm, I don't know what I'm going to be doing in this vlog. I'm just starting it and having an intro because last time I didn't have an intro and I was like, did I have an intro? Did I not have an intro? This is the Novice Sweater Mohair Edition, by the way, and I made it a high collar. What would this be called? Mock neck? I feel like it I feel like it's turtlenecky enough because it's very high, but it's Novice Sweater Mohair Edition. I used one strand of fingering weight yarn. It is Baby Wool by Hobie. Yeah, I just wanted to say that. And yeah, I'm just excited to start off a new week of vlogging. It's going to go into March because right now I'm editing a video. I'm editing vlog number seven, starting vlog number eight today. So I'm excited. Oh my gosh. I am on, I'm work, you guys know I'm working on my caramel sweater. I will show you guys what it looks like once I transfer it to another cable because I need to put on another cable soon. So I'll do that and then I'll show you guys what it looks like so far. I'm so excited. The yarn combination. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. So soft. I love it so much. But yeah, I'm going to work on that and then I will update you guys later. So I need to get some yarn for a sweater that I'm working on. It's another, it's for another video. So I'm going to go to Michael's with Malika. Oh, Malika. <laughs> and then probably go to Walmart or something, get some snacks. But I do need this yarn. It's crazy. I just need like one skein, but I'm going to get two skeins. I know I won't need two skeins, but just in case, I, I'm a just in case person. I cannot not to get yarn for a project and then like not have enough. This time I didn't plan on, I knew I wouldn't have enough. So I just wanted to see how far the yarn could go. So I wasn't playing yarn chicken. I knew I didn't have enough, but now I know I just need like one skein more. So I'll get two and then whatever I have left over, I'll use like a beanie or something. Secured. Hey, so just got back from Michael's and Walmart and all that, and I came home to some mail. It is not yarn mail, but I think these are stitch markers that I got from a small business. Let me see. <laughs> Let me just open it down below. Don't want to leave anything. Okay. Uh, it says, Kalila, thank you so, so much for your support of my little shop. I hope you enjoy your snail stitch markers. Okay, they are stitch markers. I thought so. I usually get things and I'm like, what oh, is that? Yeah, cute little note. And this is what the box come. This is what the stitch markers come in. This little box is so cute. It's my first time getting something from this business. So let's see. <gasps> Okay, so it opens like that, and it's like, oh. 
It's so blurry, but oh my god. Oh gosh. They are so cute. These are the stitch markers. So this snail. These are like these are like progress keeper stitch markers. So I can use them as progress keepers or stitch markers. Feel focus. This is the first snail. They are handmade. They are handmade. There was one that was a storm cloud and it was like crying and I wanted that one, but it sold out. And these are just like one off. So hopefully one day she'll have a rain cloud again or a storm cloud, future me. Forgot to say, I got the stitch markers from Strange Bun, Strange Bun Makes on Instagram. this yarn if you remember i was making the oslo hat with this yarn and i didn't have enough yarn for it i wanted to do like a one skein wonder type of thing and it didn't work so i'm going to do the classic ribbed hat by pearl soho free pattern you can find it literally just google pearl soho classic rib hat and it uses dk weight yarn which this is it and I have everything that I need. It uses like a 3.25 millimeter needle. And because I got this needle case, the bamboo needles, it comes with a 3.25. Usually when I see interchangeable sets, like my other interchangeable sets do not come with the 3.25. It starts off with the 3.5, but this one starts out with the 3.25, which is so perfect. So it's this one right here. So perfect on 16 inch circulars which 16 inch right here. So that's what I'm going to do today. I decided I'm just going to put my, I'm going to put my caramel sweater on the side for now because I want to start on something small. I finished my socks and I'm not going to continue my bandana for now. So I really have no other small project to work on. So I'm like, you know what? Let me do a hat. Cause I always have either hats or socks on the needles. Now I have neither like for myself i have my self jacket one but that's not for leisure or pleasure that's for like a specific thing that i'm doing for the future so i need like a little side project so i'm gonna do this hat and hopefully it comes out better than the first pearl soho hat that i did their stuff runs super big i watch other podcasters and they say that they had that problem too with pearl soho's hats being ginormous like whose heads are they fitting Come on. But I like that because many people can make the hat and be able to fit it. So I'm going to make like the adult small and cast on 108 stitches or so and see how that goes. So hopefully it goes well. We'll see. But to remind you of the yarn, it is Rocky's uh, Explore Knits and Fibers hand dyed yarn. Her Rocky's DK. Rock her. Come on, bro. Focus. It is her Rockies DK base and that's all the information and I don't feel like saying more about it because I've talked about this many times. So I'm going to start on that today and hopefully I can get it done by March 1st, you know, like maybe even Monday the 28th. We will see.
I, I don't think I've spoken in a little bit in this video. So I, as you saw, I finished a pair of socks. It took me two days to finish it, like two 24 hour days. And now I'm working on the next pair. And also I only used one ball, like one skein. And I bought two skeins each because I thought I would need more but I don't. So I'm going to have three leftover skeins and I'm going to give it to Kahila because she says she wants it and she wants to make the socks. These are the Sunday socks by Petite Knit, by the way. So they are a very, very quick knit. I 100% recommend it. Like easiest thing ever, especially if you've done socks before, because this is a heel flap and gusset type of um, construction for the heel. And then for the toe, it's like the decreases. And then like you just pull the toe and, and shut it. So that was my first time doing that part. And I was like, this is weird, but exciting. I love it so much. This is a very nice chill start to March. I want to finish all of the socks. I'm lowering my voice now because I realized Kayla's filming in there, but I want to finish my socks by Monday, which is when I want to post this vlog. So hopefully by Monday, I finish all three pairs of socks. I'm on the second sock. I I plan to finish it by today. Like I'm literally going to stay up tonight to finish it, but I don't think it'll take that long to finish as long as I actually work on it diligently. So we'll do that. And also I want, I want to continue the sweater that I'm working on for a gift. And also I want to continue my caramel sweater, but I cannot get to it just yet. I have too many other gift things I need to get out the way. And then I will get to my own personal projects and I'm not gonna do any other gifting stuff for a little bit, okay? Okay, so yeah, I think that's all for the update and I will continue knitting and my battery's about to die so I guess this is a perfect place to end. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hi, it's the next day. I have started on the second sock. I finished the first one. I'm so tired of making socks now, okay? Like, I'm ready to get back to my sweater. Or, no, because after this, I'm going to do my gift sweater. I'm just tired of making the same socks over and over. <laughs> but after I finish this one, I have one more pair, and then I'll be done with those. And then I will get to the sweater that I'm making, another gift knit, so the beginning of this month, I'm just banging out these gift knits, okay? So that the rest of the month can be, well, like the last two weeks of the month will be like work stuff. And then the middle of the week will be me just going back to my caramel sweater. So the 13th through the 19th, that's when I will go back to my caramel sweater. Yeah, we'll see how long it takes me to finish the other gift knit, the sweater gift knit. But we'll see. Anyway, this is, I don't know. I mean, I think you guys will understand having like doing the same project over and over and over and over and over. It gets annoying. Like if it's back to back, because I repeat projects for myself, but not back to back to back to back. So yeah, I'm just ready for a little change, but I'm pushing through because these are so quick. My battery is about to die, so I'm trying to speak quickly. These are so quick, so I can just get them done by Monday and just be done with them, you know? So that's what I'll do. <laughs>
I have finished one of the yellow socks. I am on the last yellow sock. And you know how I said I wanted to finish this by Monday? Ha 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 ha. No lies. You know how I get when I lose a lot of motivation for project? Yeah, I start to go slow. I started going slow on these socks and taking breaks because I just cannot deal anymore. I am so tired of knitting socks. I'm just like, oh, please, please. But anyway, I will be done with this sock by tomorrow. So I'm trying to spend all day like getting to the heel and possibly like the body and just like, ah. but yeah, I want to finish it tomorrow. So I'm just knitting up a whole bunch, a whole bunch, a whole section. I want to get through the cuff part, which is very long. It's like the cuff and leg combined, then get to the heel and yeah, and hopefully be done by tomorrow's Thursday and then probably Friday morning. Like Friday morning is fine because then I can edit this video, post it. I don't usually edit and post on the day I'm supposed to like post a video, but since I'm being so lazy with these socks, I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to have to do that. So, you know, that's what we're going to do, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm going to push through. If you are on my Instagram, you already know how I'm feeling. And I'm just like, I'm ready to be done, but it's okay. As I'm saying this, you know, these are gift knits. I'm just like, I'm going to knit something for myself. I'm already planning like another gift knit for someone else. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Gift knitting is so great. Like, I love gift knitting so much, but once I get into the process of it, I'm just like, why did I do this? But then it's still great. Okay, anyway, that's a lot of talking. I'm gonna get back to knitting. Hopefully the next clip you see of me will be me telling you, hallelujah, I finished, and hopefully that's tomorrow. So we'll see. I'm done. Finished the socks. Hallelujah, which means I have finished every single one of those socks. Now I can get back to working on this sweater. Oh, did I drop something? Oh, my thing came off my needle stopper. But yeah, I can finally get back to this. I only have the sleeve left and then I'll be done with that. But that's for another video. So. That is the end of this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was such a random vlog. I literally have to go back and see what was happening because I don't remember how I started this vlog. Anyway, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to give this video a thumbs up. Subs <gasps> I can't speak. Subscribe if you're new and you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys in my next video, which will probably be about the sweater that I just showed you. If not, it'll be a podcast, but I think it'll be the sweater. Yeah. It'll be the sweater. Okay, bye. <laughs>